Welcome back to Beancast, the weekly show where I give my opinion that nobody wants. Amazing intro, please. I don't have an intro. Just joking. Uh, so today I'll be talking about. I'm sure you saw the title somewhere down there that says, "Um, I'll be talking about the off season and some more." Now the now the intro we play, but I don't have to. All right, so um. I'm going to be talking about it all the way back with Rivera. This is my third try. I've almost gotten to the end. Then someone barged in my door over there. Wrecked the whole thing. Would you believe it? So anyways. Let's talk about... Uh, Ron Rivera. Of course, that's what we started out with. Actually, let's start with the Bruce Allen. That guy. I've already forgotten his name. The old president that they fired. He was garbage. I mean, he, saw, he said the culture was pretty freaking good. That is the best. People were saying fire and fire at fire Bruce Allen. If you went on Twitter, every single post, it was hashtag fire Bruce Allen, fire Bruce Allen, fire Bruce Allen, fire Bruce Allen. And they did it. And now he just needs to sell the team. <laughs> Give it to somebody else, please. <sighs> yep. That's what I have to say about Bruce Allen. I think he should sell the team and that really make everyone happy. And they got the new head coach Ron Rivera, which I think was a great hire. I mean, he was probably he, that guy. If you can hear him, he's not banging on my door. Um, that would make no sense if you can't hear him. I'm going off track. Ron Rivera. The reason he was fired from Carolina, I think, was more the players going bad. Than him doing that. Okay? I think that whenever the Redskins, when we went into their stadium, I was actually at that game. I lived right next to Charlotte. And we smacked them 29 to 21. I mean, it was 29 to 14. And when I was up in that stadium, all I could see was just blue jerseys just leaving the stadium. And we were all like, it was great. My dad uh, was gonna get a Panther suck pants started, but they they cried, quieted him down. Anyways, what's it called? Uh, I, I keep on going off track again. This is gonna be a bad episode. I can already tell. Oh yeah, so he was fired more for the players doing bad than him doing bad. I mean, if you look, at, if we watched that game, it seemed like a pretty big blowout when it was twenty nine fourteen. But he was leading a comeback. He was doing all the right plays. Just Kyle Allen was underperforming. I mean, in the first quarter, they scored 14 points. They we they were up 14 to nothing. And like we were always sitting up there in our Redskins jerseys, just going like, "Are you kidding me? We have to sit here and watch this." But I, I was gonna sit there. I mean, it's a football game. I had to like go buy a. Panthers jersey and stuff. My brother had a Redskins shirt on and a Panthers shirt on underneath it because we are secondary Panthers fans. You would have took it off. Good luck. Anyways, so also that Jack DeVio guy, I don't know, that guy from Oakland that they signed the defensive coordinator. I mean, if Oakland, Vegas, whatever, liked them, the Raiders liked them. I mean, maybe we will too. I think, I think he was like, he, he's old, so he's got that good experience. I, I don't know much about him, like Jack the Leo guy. Uh, I know that he was in Oakland, something in Oakland. I knew, I knew more about him than before. Don't know much about him now. All right, let's talk about something. I do like that they cleaned house. They finally realized, like. Van finally realized, like, we're not getting anything done. Like, look, just fire everybody, get them out of there, everyone except for Doug Long. I do think, though, that they should get Alex Smith to work in the front office. I heard stuff about them offering, potentially offering him um, a spot up there, and that, I think that's a good way to go. I really do. So, anyways. Talk about Trent Williams. I've already, 
I only spent five minutes talking about them. But are there any signings that they made? They got rid of Quentin Dunbar. Quentin Dunbar basically just left, and that is he was our leader in interceptions. I mean, he was like one of my favorite defensive players. We had other than like Landon Collins, Monte Sweat, my Ian Iris, and all those guys. He was very good. He got interceptions all the time. Now, and we got rid of Josh Norman too, which is a great move. So now Josh Norman's probably never going to play again after how badly he did with us. So, let's think. What else? I honestly think Fabian Rose is going to be good. Steven Sims, he started to explode towards the end of the season. I, wa I still watched the last few games because they came on my TV. But he was the one with that last game. He was the one very good. No matter how bad KST and him are doing in half games or the he was the one pretty good. Him and Terry McLaurin and who, who else? Ah, I can't think of anyone. I'm supposed to be the biggest Redskins fan. Oh my, I, I'm just... We've got... Terry McLaurin, I've got a Jerry thing in there. Darius guys, Adrian Peterson, my Ionitis, we got Foster, we got Kerrigan. Kerrigan, no one's talking about Kerrigan. He's pro ball for a while. Yeah. Um, what else? Oh yeah, it's talking about Trent Williams. So, about Trent Williams. He, his agents, it's been said that since Ron Rivera is the head coach, and he just, uh, sorry, I have my crab cage back there, and ants are in there, and I'm pretty sure they've eaten them, which is kind of sad, but I don't really care. He's been around for way too long. I'm trying to kill an ant right now. Killing so many ants lately because I don't want them to get in there, but I can tell they already have. It's very sad. But, and I think they should. I mean, he was a Pro Bowl um, offensive line, and we need a good offensive line if we're going to let Dwayne Haskins. Um, if we're going to let Dwayne Haskins throw and get better, and there he is, guys, who's already one of the best, in my opinion, running backs in the league. We're gonna let them grow. And I think we need to have a good offensive line, and Trent Williams can really help that. Which is another reason why the Ron Rivera hire is so good. I just wonder what Jay Gruden's thinking, because the Jaguars hired him as a defensive coordinator, so he's either thinking, I'm oh, let's go Jaguars, yeah. I wonder if they play him. I haven't checked on the. Because um, even though they haven't put out the record yet, you can see what teams are gonna be playing. For this year and all but two of their games for next year. So I'm wondering if they're playing the Jaguars this year. That would be interesting though if they got to meet back up with Jay Gruden. Went from head coach to defensive coordinator. I thought he, he was more offensive minded. I, re I really think because he just made it throw, 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 throw. He was very aggressive offensive mind. But when you have a crappy offense, it's kind of hard to be offensive minded and throwing and going risky plays all the time. I mean, we were the first team who had a lead on the Patriots when we had a 7 0 lead. And then we didn't score again for the rest of the game. And they knocked the park 12 to 7 at halftime. And I was like, what? Did you, did you see that? It's only 12 to 7. We're keeping them in this. And then we lost. So, yeah, that's, that's basically what I've been thinking. I know no one's going to watch this far. But if you are and you'd like to see more of this stuff, because, you know, at this point, last one only got two views. Someone said nice content, though. That's why I'm acting like it's a weekly thing. So, right now, with my 40 monthly views, please, please, please give it a like and subscribe. Just, just one like. I rarely, rarely, rarely get like. So if I could get a like, that would be music set. That is just as good as a comment telling me we like this. That tells me keep on making more. You like this, you want to see more of this. 
Now, if you just kind of like it, you can like it. And you can comment, like, I don't like it. <laughs> um, if you don't think I should make any more of these, if you do think I should make any more of these, comment, please. Now, if this offended you for some reason, dislike it, okay? If you, like, you felt offended by this, I don't know what would offend you, but dislike. Yeah. Anyways. Goodbye.